today we'd like to talk on a new angle to how may how to make our online training more effective online training has lots of benefits and uh, especially what gvf has done it is an evolved program for over last 15 years i am happy to be associated with this program for more than 10 years and i have been doing gvf hands on skills test so when we do the test usually the students come to our facility to run the tests and we have come to know that in some of the modules they get stuck up they need some kind of a human interface to guide them help them now i am glad to say that satprof has been supporting this challenge as well remotely we are telephone calls and otherwise guiding on a chat but having a person on site makes all the difference saying this you cannot say that online training is ineffective it's extremely effective and it has lots of benefits of having <coughs> updated knowledge new technology is getting added and incorporated take an example initially we started with gbf basic trainings which was just level 1 and level 2 as the technology changed newer modules newer concepts needs to be added and then we rephrase the entire entry level program to two two levels basic and advanced and in the basic we had gbf 510 as a module and 520 521 was more elaborate in short for a novice it's it's like uh, if you do a 510 you are good to install reduce interference do an interference free installation but if you do 520 and 521 as well then you know the reason and the logic behind why we want to do an installation in a particular manner anyway so <coughs> going ahead uh, we were doing lot of online courses and then running the hands on and when this request came that we need a person to help finish the program so we came with a concept of mentoring the training the whole program works as if there's a group of 5 or 10 or 15 or even one student they would first select the right online module register and start working on it after a period of time maybe 10 days 5 days depends on how long they want to finish the module because we have an access for all these online modules for a longer period of time and once they are done if they are stuck up with one lesson or one topic that's fine they come to our facility or we go on site and then we we go a day prior help them clear their doubts finish off their online module help them finish the online module so they understand and then do the hands on skills test so that being said we we started doing this for many many companies government agencies uh, ngos and different bodies worldwide and then we got more request that in this why don't you value add so we value added by having a group discussion after everyone finishes the online course we talk about the on ground realities which we face in doing these installations challenges we face like in some of the developing countries we have seen people using a vsat as a cloth cloth line to dry their clothes so these kind of challenges come and how how to how to meet these challenges So here are some of the glimpses of uh, lots of successful online training followed by on-site mentoring and host exam done world over. One of the interesting one of the interesting program we've been doing since 2012 is a joint military exercise by US DOD called as Pacific Endeavor in which The main theme is multi-country interoperability program, and there are 25 plus countries from Asia Pacific region 
who team together for two weeks to learn various technologies and which can be utilized for humanitarian aid and disaster mitigation. And in that we have been working, giving the GVF online trainings, certification and mentoring on site at various locations worldwide. Initially the classroom where they work on the online courses and then comes the practicals and the demos and hands-on skills test which checks students on their ability to properly install, deinstall, point accurately, more important to a beam balance to have a good and a robust link which does not interfere or create interferences. In addition to the military and the military trainings we have done a lot for the industry as well for the UN agencies for the peacekeeping forces for the NGOs in supporting SATCOM for their <coughs> communications. This is the entire concept which was built by Mehdibagh Computers or MBC India to mentor GVF online trainings and host exams created by SATPROF. We have done these trainings for clients like GulfSat, ST Electronics, IntelSat, SES, the list is huge and we expand on this and develop more and more hands-on mentoring on site. What kind of customers have you provided the mentor training for? Uh, if you look at segments we have done for the military, for the NGOs and uh, humanitarian aid workers. Then if you look at industry, we have done for a lot of telcos, satellite uh, operators, ground system operators and uh, service providers. Name a few I had mentioned earlier is right from US DOD and the joint military exercise of 20, 25 plus militaries in Asia Pac region to UN agencies and uh, from the industry I can talk right from Middle East we had from Gulf Sat to of course India we had a lot of customers and then SES Intel Sat goes all the way to PNG and then in between we had done for Miasat, ST Electronics this is a big list and uh, this actually leads us to talk to the actual participants and uh, understand their future needs. So they keep on telling us what more needs to be done. And this Knowledge Center subscription is an excellent initiative by SATPROF in which for one year we sign a student who starts with basically a 510 and does a hands-on. And then when we do mentoring on site, we discuss with them what are the other modules that they can do from the bouquet of 30 plus uh, online modules under the subscription and which is which is available for them for a full one year to access and invariably we try telling them to do courses on spectrum analyzer or if they are for marine then we suggest to go in go ahead with marine certifications then some of the platform specifics, whether it is Hughes or iDirect or Gilad. So depending on the networks they operate, we suggest and they keep doing it. And which really builds a lot of capacities with, uh, with the user, user group. I'm really happy that uh, those whom we have trained have regular be regularly been in touch with us. Even if they face some challenges on the ground, they send an email or call us and we respond to them. A classic example is of African Development Bank for whom we did this mentor training across Africa in four or five locations, South Africa, Kenya, Tunisia, Ivory Coast and more. So they have been in touch regularly and if they face any challenges, they get back to us. Same happened from Miasat as well and uh, from PNG, just to give a few examples.
of course, UN agencies and uh, participants at DOD uh, often get in touch with us and uh, ask us what more trainings that we can do together. And how would we contact MBC to talk about, to schedule a, a mentor training? Um, best way out is reach out to SATPROF or you can reach us on our URL and uh, we coordinate and get the work done. Simple. What we specialize is we send the GVF uh, certified examiners on site and then these people, they are also the trainers, MBC trainers, and they go and do the things. Now, uh, if you look at it commercially also, it's really uh, cost-saving and competitive. Say for instance, a company has five executives for GVF host, which means they have to travel to any of the nearest host examiner location. So there is a travel and living for five people and all the incidental costs. Instead, what we do is we conduct the host and this mentor training is at no extra cost. All we, all we want is the standard host fee and to cover the travel and living for two of our resources coming on site to do the work. So when you want five people certified, you pay for only two persons travel and living. It's as simple maths as that. Another important thing is, uh, we don't pull out from their active work and uh, duties. We usually try to go on site and run the mentor training on a weekend so that they are not out of the active work and duty, especially field tech, when they travel across the geography for installation and field support, it's, it's really demanding to pull them out and send them for a training. Although we reach them with the content online, but when it comes to host, they have to come to one location. Instead, we go to their location and get this thing coordinated. Thanks, Thanks for the good opportunity from SATPROF and GVF, and we look forward to scaling up this mentor training program along with SATPROF on a long-term basis. Thank you very much.